Lemuel Rivera, Anthony Velez, Angel Rosado, and our coach, Manserrano. We're from Manuela Toro Maurice High School, and this is our project, it's Solar Bowl. The team began activities in August 2010, and now we're composed of six students. And we're from Caguas, Puerto Rico. Our mission is to assign and build technological tools to help us make uh, easier scientific research to help reduce possible human risks. This boat, if you can see here, MTM-306 is the name of the boat. Use an area recognition or camera to watch the marine life and a marine special. The solar boat has basically an engine and mechanical device adapted to the project. The first day of the project was the concept of the construction, the ideas that we have, look for the internet books, and then we put on the paper. You can see right here the photos. Then we, we do the prototype in minor scale, and then we do the project in major scale that you can see here. <laughs> then we have the, the question that you ask is the, the, the work, the function, we work the project. The solar boat MTN 306 is a solar boat with four motors, two in both sides, a solar panel of 12 volts, and it will have a camera to watch the marine life. It has a size of 39 inches of large, 3 feet, and it has a weight of 28 pounds. We start the project drawing a design of the boat, then we create a prototype, and finally we start building the structure of the boat with PVC pipes. Then we get help of, a, of an expert to apply the fiberglass because it's a toxic and dangerous material. And the final step was install the electrical pump that have two servo engines that function as three switches. One to give power to the circuit and the other two to control the direction of the boat. Right, so in conclusion the project was a success and not only did the boat mess just stay afloat, it moved about three miles per hour in the water. Very great speed. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank Thank you.